create infinite possibilities. Let me paint you a visual. I want to do something a little bit different from part three. There has been testimonies as to what hell actually looks like. And from listening to such testimonies, try to describe it in AI art formation does not do justice because we actually hear in and visualizing the destructiveness and severity of what hell truly is. Part one and part two was an idea to really have you understand how real the place is. The images or videos you see here for part three is nothing to be played around with. I'm going to continue the hell art. But I want to warn you ahead of time. Rather you watch it in 2024, 25 or beyond. That what the visions seen does not do justice towards the pain for those who were brought back for a second chance to tell these stories. So for part three, moving four, just know that each and every video is going to be very gruesome, very destructive, in order for you, the visualizer, as well the listener, to really understand that this is a place you do not want to be at. Books can only do justice. But I think it's time for folks to actually see how destructive hell really is. It's a spiritual war that has been going on for centuries. And it's intensifying. And your soul hangs on the balance. This is just not for unbelievers. It's for my Christian brothers and sisters as well too. It's for those who think that your walk with Christ is perfect and it's not. We understand God's love. But do you truly understand the severity of his wrath? And if you don't, I highly suggest that you truly talk to God one-on-one -on -one by yourself in a quiet space and really ask God to search your heart. To hear from different testimonies that they've seen all walks of life in hell, including Christians, those of us who have not forgiven or have not let go of the bondage of sin that we're stuck in and have fell short of God's glory to their kingdom and its information. That is not good to hear. For you, the unbeliever, you may say, wow, that sounds like an oxymoron. It isn't. Especially when you don't ask God for true repentance and true healing. 
So let me paint you this visual. Hell is not a place you want to be at. And the visuals for it. It's going to be extremely disturbing. Welcome to Let Me Paint You a Visual Studios. We're changing the format for everything this year.